I went through a very rough, a rough patch in my life. And I think I prolonged the season because I did not want to accept. Uh, being in this industry for so long, you were told that your life always has to be perfect. You not told. You are it's expected. An expectation. It's an expectation that everything needs to be perfect. And when life happened, things did not make sense to me, and in a way, I was embarrassed. I dealt with um, depression and anxiety for a very long time. I was actually even too embarrassed to go for help. First of all, my mother is a psychotic. It makes so much sense to me. <laughs> I don't know if it makes sense to everybody, but it makes perfect sense to me why you would stop being able to sing yeah. if you're not in a good place. True. Was that the wake-up call for you? No, not yet. It wasn't. Oh. No. Oh, wow. The wake-up call was a bleeding ulcer for me. I was in hospital all alone at night. And you could hear the nurses talking. I thought I'd get depression. <laughs> <laughs> That's still for me. But I was like, w why am I here? What is it that I can do to get better? And I started fighting from that day on. Uh, the, fir the project that I released in 2014, I th for me, was the hardest because I was really fighting tooth and nail. Somehow I managed to sing in studio, and it was a beautiful project. But I think it was a battle of the mind more than anything else at that point in time.